In today's recipe, we're going to be making a crispy fried fish stir fry. This is a spicy and flavor packed stir fry in which we'll use sea bass or any white fish which has been deep fried in a crispy tempura batter. The fish is then briefly added to the stir fry before being served so that it retains its crispy texture yet is still packed with flavor. The recipe should make enough for about two portions and be ready from scratch in around 30 minutes. So on screen now are the ingredients, as always a full list of those ingredients will be on our blog post. A link to that will be in the description box just below this video. Ok so let's get started, begin by deep frying two sea bass fillets or any white fish which have been cut into bite sized pieces and mixed with two tablespoons of tempura flour and an eighth teaspoon of salt. Deep fry until the fish is crispy and golden brown. Next heat three tablespoons of cooking oil in a wok and when hot add in two cloves of finely chopped garlic and then fry the garlic for about 20 seconds. Then add in two tablespoons of sliced krachai and stir fry with the garlic for about one minute until the krachai begins to brown. Next add in five pairs of torn kaffir lime leaves and stir fry everything for another 30 seconds or so. Then add in three sliced bird eye chilies, three tablespoons of fresh peppercorn, two tablespoons of oyster sauce and one and a half tablespoons of fish sauce. Continue stir frying for about a minute or two and then add in one tablespoon of water just to stop the mixture from getting too dry. Also add in the deep fried crispy fish that we made earlier and then stir fry for about 30 seconds or so making sure that you mix the sauce in with the fish but be sure not to cook the fish for too long as we don't want it to get soggy. Then just serve with some steamed rice and enjoy. And that's all there is to it. We hope you enjoyed the recipe. If you have any questions just leave a comment below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. If you like this and you want to see lots more Thai and Asian inspired recipes then do subscribe to our channel. We've got lots more recipes still to come. So thanks for watching and we'll see you again on the next video.